that's the direction we're headed. And, and, yeah, and you know what? I got a good feeling we're going to get there somewhere. What are your thoughts in general, Coach, just on having a proper championship? I mean, that's something that the Mountain West has never had before, and that way there won't be a uh, you know, potential split championship like there has been. You know, I think it's outstanding. In, in having been in some leagues where uh, conference championship games are there, I, I think what it'll do is it'll just help the exposure of this conference and the Mountain West Conference in general because we'll get that highlight game where a lot of people, you know, in other parts of the country who don't even know that we play football out here, uh, they'll get a chance to see, you know, really good football, good coaching, and, and good players. And I think it's something that'll just help the Mountain West as we move forward. Process. He always talks about the process as well. <clears throat> you know, anytime you come in and, and your culture's one thing, you're trying to change something else, it, it might take a while. And, and um, you know, for me, even it, it took a while for me to, you know, kind of come around to his ideas and, and the way he wants to do things. But, you know, this this spring and this summer, it's, it's gotten, you know, night and day difference. Um, we've started to really take hold of what he's all about, um, you know, what, what he expects from us. Um, you, you can see a, a complete difference in the attitude of my teammates and myself. Um, and it's been a huge, huge uh, offseason for us in, in trying to, you know, get, get, to, get to doing what he wants us to do. They uh, come play hard every time, and they like want to show like, that he's not a, a, a slouch, he's not an easy opponent, and we want to show that we're not an easy opponent, too. We want to prove that we're, like, we're better. I know they're going to come and do the same thing, and it's, a, it's just a good game every time, and I look forward to it, and I hopefully hopefully we win again this year, and I can go out 3-0 no against Mexico, because that'll be good. It's probably one of the only teams that I go undefeated against, if it was that this year. You got to do is look at the little historic uh, precedence that's been set. You know, this conference has sent some great teams into really good bowl games and what. And I think the strength of the Mountain West Conference is something that will go ahead and, and, and raise its head. And the awareness will become, you know, more and more where we're in that mix. And, and you know, there's really good programs, there's really good coaches. And, you know, I'm excited to be part of it. Bond and build stage uh, where, you know, we want our guys to truly understand the work family and truly understand what it means to know more about each individual than just their name or jersey number, which then helps you build a program. And that's something that we're still we're still working on and yet our guys are doing a great job of it. And obviously, you know, it comes down to recruiting. You know, you, you keep recruiting to your system and make sure that it fits and and you know what? We've got a bright future at Colorado yeah, State. And we had two guys that played a lot last year, and, and both of them have been, you know, working on leadership. Mm -hmm. um, one of the things we really stressed in this offseason mm -hmm. was who's going to step up and make this their team. And so I'll be excited to see in August which one of those guys took those strides and, and are ready to really take the reins of this team. Absolutely. Um, you know, you start camp, I guess there's probably three or four days before the So you start it just like any other one. Once it gets around that time, you start with the most important game prep in. That goes uh, into uh, helping the team be better, uh, letting young guys know what it's about, and really being able to communicate with them. And it was an experience. Well, I think the first thing you do is to have a solid vision from the top and a direction that you have. That's number one. We've already started to attack the things that were issues we, when we took the job. There's certain things that you, you don't try to get all the issues at once because now you're not going to get any of them. So you create a hierarchy of issues and you attack those issues. I think the suits are the you know, I'm not going to go into that, but I have no idea. This is even not being able to play the 